Tonight, Southwest Allen County School Board members met for the first time since a photo of a white student at Homestead depicted in blackface went viral. That image created a larger conversation on the topic of racism between the parents, the students, and the administrators. 21 Alive's Alex Snow was at tonight's meeting, and he has this. Alex. Now, although that image was not a topic on tonight's board meeting agenda, parents still shared their thoughts and feelings with the board on how the last few weeks had been for them. Although Sachs has an outstanding academic history, statements are made amongst minority families such as, don't send your kids there, you will not be treated right out there. Tuesday night, Southwest Allen County School Board members met for the first time since a racist image of a white student at Homestead depicted in blackface went viral on social media. Some parents attended Tuesday's meeting to advocate for minority students. When you feel like you're not being heard, what better forum than the school board that, that we're trying to address? Ashley Washington and April Gregg are members of a group called FACTS, which stands for Freedom Against Cultural Transgressions in Schools. The group was created to protect minority students from facing discrimination in school. They say there's work to be done in that area and that it starts with better communication from administrators. I'm a very engaged and um, active parent, and so I just want that same energy uh, to reciprocate with me, especially when there's things of this magnitude going on within the schools. Look forward to hearing what you have to say. And again. SAC Superintendent Park Ginder says administrators are working on listening to and learning from parents and students. All of us are learning. All of us are faulty. Um, so having our faults or having some things challenged is going to be a good thing for us long term. And we'll just keep working at it. FACTS members say part of the issue is that minority students face harsher punishments in schools. 21 Investigates dove into the data last month, which showed black students were suspended at higher rates. Greg and Washington both say they wish student punishments were more consistent across the board. Um, it is not not obviously about white versus black because no. I'm standing here next to my new sister. <laughs> um, it, it's just about equality and the punishment. As for what's next for the district, Superintendent Ginder sent a letter home to parents outlining the plan. The minority student union at Homestead High School will work with other students to foster understanding. Now that includes hosting culture nights and celebrating minority history. The district is also bringing, it, bringing in diversity coach Will Moreland. He'll lead a student assembly and group discussions next month. Brian.